Um, I really don't have a plan. You would think I had a plan, but I don't have a plan. You'll feel the world of pain. Oh God, Giovanni, please don't, please don't destroy me. Butterfree, go! All right, well, we're gonna take on Erica, guys. Uh, this is the team that we're bringing. Erica is very challenging because she does have a pseudo Wudo that has head smash, and I don't really have a single switch into that on my entire team. Um, but I am gonna try to beat it with Scarborn. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump into the trainers in the gym, uh, beat them all up. Oh, I gotta level up Dust Docs real quick, and then we should be good to go. Let's get Dust Docs to 45. Quiver Dance and Dust Docs, baby. No, you're defensive today, buddy. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh god, I'm not that much of an idiot because he didn't KO me. I just switched to. What am I doing? Switch a poison type into- oh wait, no, that's- that's the dragon one, never mind. He shouldn't have had Psyche. What is he doing? Why do they have Psychic? Alright, I'm gonna stick to what I was doing. Alright, it's Erica time, baby. If you're watching after the fact, like the video. Subscribe if you're new, let's get it. Ay ay ay. Lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant, I must have dozed off. Welcome, my name is Erica and I'm the leader of Celadon. Uh, you would think that bugs would easily beat this, but again, it is not- uh, you can't get Earthquake yet, Rock. It is not, uh, it's not gonna be an easy one. If I get through this without any deaths, I'll be very happy. Alright, Rillaboom kicks off. It's gonna set up the terrain. I got Walnut here. Walnut is feeling fancy as always. Walnut's job is just set up set up a spike right now. I think he's gonna U-turn. I'm just gonna set up a spike. Yeah, he does U-turns. I really want a Rocky Helmet, but that's okay. That should give us Sturdy back though, so we might be able to save this. It's gonna be Meganium coming in, which means HP Fire is gonna happen. He gets a Grassy Seed, which is for his defense. Okay. So he's gonna definitely HP fire here. You know what I meant to do? I kind of messed up. I meant to actually give, um, oof. I meant to give U-turn to Masquerade. That's right though. All right, HP fire is coming my way, and you would think I had a plan right now, but I, I really don't. Um, I really don't have a plan. You would think I had a plan, but I don't have a plan. Um, I could go Crimson and take the HP fire, and then go for Poison Tail. Let me see if that does enough. Yeah, Poison Tail doesn't KO at plus one defense, so that's not an option. It's a two at KO, and I'd have to take an Ancient Power to the face. Come in and go for an Air Slash. I think I'm gonna have to. I don't think I have a choice. All right, we're going Majora. I'm gonna take this HP Fire to the face. This thing's gonna Giga Drain me and do a lot of damage, I think. Here comes a Hidden Power Fire. All right, so that's good. We take that. I, I'm curious if he Giga Drains or if he Ancient Powers here. I think he Giga Drains, dude. I'm gonna be honest, I think he's gonna Giga Drain here. I think he's gonna Giga Drain. I kinda wanna switch, but... I think I gotta go for one Air Slash and see. He does Giga Drain. Okay, so at least I know the AI Giga Drain's here. I'm gonna get like half off, and I can potentially get into... I can potentially go into my Scolipede now, and this should hopefully put him in Poison Tail range. Eh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. Um... It's like kind of right on the cusp. This is why I wanted U-turn on this thing. All right, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna make the play and hope he Giga Drains again and go into Crimson here. He Giga Drains again. Okay, that's the good news. He's gonna do very little, and it's gonna allow me to get off a of Poison Tail. I really could use a crit right now. That would be swell. I right, get a little health. All right, we're gonna go for the Poison Tail. A crit would be phenomenal. I think it's a high crit move. Hey, Crimson clutches right there. I didn't expect that to KO. That was a really, really good clutch there. Okay. That worked out better than I thought. Now let's see if Pseudo Wudo comes in. Or what comes in next. Probably Pseudo Wudo. It is gonna be Pseudo Wudo, okay. So we know a head smash is coming. This is very important. I can only switch in a head smash one time. So, I'm going into Scarborn. I could take one head smash, and I one-shot this thing with close combat. I can only take one, though. Actually, if I if I Megahorn, there's no way a Megahorn's gonna KO, though. A pseudo Wudo, right? Let me look. If I straight up just click Megahorn here... Nah, it's not gonna do enough. I'm 45, Adamant, he's 43. Four. It's so close, but I'm gonna miss. I don't think it's worth the risk. I think I'm going Scarborn here. Yeah, that's the play. That's the play. Just don't crit me with a head smash. 
Just don't crit me with head smash. I really need hair cross in this run. Just don't crit me. Just don't crit me. Okay. Now I need Pseudo Wudo to stay in here. I need it to stay in. I need it to stay in right now. It sucker punches, we always live. Yes, okay. That worked out. What's up, Real? Thanks for the sub love. That worked out, this should KO. Yes, okay. You did your job, Scarborn, you did it. You really did your job. I got you just for this battle. You get a Moxie boost, that's fine. I really would love to see Rillaboom next. I'd love to see Rillaboom next. Give me Rillaboom next. It's not gonna be Rillaboom. It's gonna be Venusaur. Whoa, wait a minute. Do I? Hold up. I'm definitely faster and I'm plus one. No, I went adamant. I might not be faster, just kidding. Okay. All right, that's fine. So I have I have a guaranteed Venusaur switch in here, which is Shedinja every time. All he can do to me is Sleep Powder, and, and it just puts me to sleep. I meant to put a Chester Berry on it, but that's fine. So we're gonna go Spectre. All he can do is Sleep Powder me, which is what I'm assuming he's gonna do. But he can't hurt me otherwise. You can't hurt me. And then that means Superior comes in next. Like he's probably gonna sleep, and then I think Superior just comes in. He Giga Drains, doesn't work. Okay, I'm actually curious if he sleeps. I don't know if he will, because I anticipated Superior to come in, but because he missed the, the... I think he's gotta go Superior. Yo, what's up, Quack? I think he's gotta go Superior, so I'm gonna Aerial Ace just in case. He actually stays in and sleeps, okay. But I think now he switches, because he can't actually hit me otherwise. So Superior has to come in, because it's the only thing that can touch Spectre. So because I know Superior is coming in, I should be able to go Scolipede. He should switch out. It does switch out. Superior's gotta come in. Okay, that's good. He's gonna take a layer of spike, which means he doesn't have his, uh, he doesn't have his, whatchamacallit. I just click protect. He double switches. Oh, that's annoying. That's annoying. Okay, this is okay though. I, I never lose this situation, right? I never lose this situation, because I just go Spectre every time and he can't touch it, and then I just double back into Skullipede every time, and it's gonna have to keep switching out, and I know he wants to switch, so I'll just go for the Mega Horn. Yeah, I, we're good. And now, I think I straight win. I think I straight win. I can risk it, but I can also just, um, just stay in. Does Rillaboom come next? It's gonna be superior, so yeah, I just, I just am good now. Pretty sure I can Poison Tail for the win here. I don't wanna risk missing a Mega Horn because all it can do to me is HP Fire and it's not gonna KO. So actually, I'll go for a Steamroller because it has a chance to flinch. And it's gonna KO anyway. We're gonna get through Erica, baby! That's what I'm talking about! Woo! Okay. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about, guys. All right, here comes Rillaboom, and again, I'm just gonna play this super duper safe. Rillaboom has U-turn, high horsepower, draining punch, and or drain punch and grassy glide. While Crimson can seal the deal here, there is no reason for me to take any chances and get crit or something. We just go Spectre, and Spectre sits here and clicks Will-O-Wisp. He can't touch me. Take a nap, take some air release to the face, and Spectre does it again, baby. Mmm. I cannot afford to lose this Shininja at any point in this run because if we lose Shininja, we are in a very bad spot because we now know the AI, how it's going to work. If it can sleep you, it will. Otherwise, it's always switching out on Shininja, which means once we get Toxic, we get Toxic things. Once we get, you know, we have Willow already, we can customize that. Once we get a Focus Sash, we give ourselves an extra life for this thing. It's going to be so good. So getting through Erica, no deaths is massive, guys. That is a massive win for us. But now we have to deal with Giovanni, so we'll have some fun with that. Um, big yikes for me, dog. Okay, well that was a good good battle for us. We needed that one. That was a good battle for us. Okay, woo! Okay, let me get out of here, dude. I need to get out of this place. I don't know if I battled you already. I need to heal and then we can battle Giovanni and then we're gonna do this opening. Woo, I got through, I got through. Gosh, man. You know, what's crazy is like when you're not doing bug, these, these trainers are not a problem, but when you're just doing bug only, even just the average trainer is like ridiculous because you just don't have good switch-ins.
I don't have to battle any more trainers. We go to the fourth floor. This should get me to Giovanni. Okay. It's going down against Giovanni. This is not, by any stretch of the imagination, an easy battle. Um, I think it's winnable, but it could also go very badly. So, wish me luck. I'm gonna I'm gonna just jump into it. Um, I have the team. I think everybody's ready. I'm gonna just do a double check over everything. We lead Messel. We click Sticky Web, right? That's that's the first thing. Um, it's got Chesterberry so I can rest. We've got Battle Armor Lasagna with Rock Slide. We need to not miss. We've got Elsa here, which is modest. This is uh, our best way to deal with Nidoking. We've got Majora, which is also modest with the Wakan Berry and Scald and Quick Attack, which allows us to beat Infernape. And then we've got Walnut, which is just defensive and has Volt Switch to deal with Kangaskhan. And you're obviously Heracross and you are here for Rotom as well, because you can get burned by Willow and do some damage, so. I must say I'm impressed you got here. Team Rocket captures Pokemon from around the world. They're important tools for keeping our criminal enterprise going. You'll feel the world of pain. Oh God, Giovanni, please don't, please don't destroy me. Please don't destroy me. All right, he's gonna lead Nido King. Oh, you're right, S1, that's a great idea. All right, we click a sticky web, and he's gonna earth power. We should take this, that's good. All right, now we're gonna sticky web. Get them webs up. And then I think I'm gonna power split. He's gonna switch out. I get a power split off on something else. What is it though? It's Honchkrow, okay. That's actually fine. Uh, that means the Honchkrow does way less damage right now, which is a-okay. So we're gonna go lasagna now. I still have to deal with that Nido King later though, so that's gonna be a problem. Here comes the drill pack, but I cannot be critical hit. And it does nothing. Perfect. Okay, now I click Rock Slide. I really want a Stealth Rock, but I think he's gonna. S does he stay in? I feel like Stealth Rock is so good. Stay in. He stayed in. Okay, I made the right play. I just need to not miss. Lasagna! I'm the best crustal main in North America, for those who do not know, and Lasagna has come through and obliterated the Honchkrow. That's a big threat down. All right, here comes Kang. All right, we know Kang wants to fake out. So now we're gonna go, we assume he wants to fake out. If he doesn't fake out, I might be in trouble, but we're gonna go Walnut. All right, I need him to fake out right now, okay? He switches. Okay, so that's that's important. We're gonna need to, oh, Infernape comes out next. This is actually going better than I thought it was gonna go. This is actually not, not that bad, dude. So far, this is actually not that bad. Okay. Now I go Majora. And we Scald, Scald gets the KO here. He may switch out in a Rotom here, which would be annoying. He doesn't. I just I just clean the uh, infernape. Nice, dude. Sticky wet, baby. Let's go. Okay, infernape's gone. Here comes Rotom. Okay, so Rotom, Rotom. I need to figure out. Like Rotom is one of the problems right now for sure, because I think he Volt switches here, right? I think I gotta go Messel and try to get a Toxic off if he stays in, but I don't know if it's gonna work. I think he's gonna Volt Switch. He Willows, okay. I really need to get a Toxic off, but I think he's gonna just Volt Switch out into Nido King. I think I'm gonna go for it anyway and hope he stays in. Yeah, he Volt Switches, all right. That may just, that actually may be really bad. It's King. Okay, I'm pretty sure from the damage earlier I can take one more Earth Power. So I'm gonna stay in and I'm gonna rest. Yeah, I can definitely take another one, I'm gonna rest. What's up, Real? Thanks for the sub love, man. Nice. All right, we have Chesto Berry, so I always uh, come in on this, I'm fine. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do now, he's gonna wanna Earth Power me, so my play here is I have, I'm full health, so I just go Elsa now, and then we just click Ice Beam now. He's gonna switch it out. Into what, though? Into Kang. That's annoying. That's annoying. Okay. He's gonna fake out, right? I think you still go Walnut. I think I gotta play this slow. I'm really surprised he switched out there. Fake out again. This is where Rocky Helmet would have been massive, dude. Think of how much damage I'd be doing right now if I had Rocky Helmet. All right, I'm clicking Volt Switch. It's gonna switch out every time, so it does not stay in on Fortress. And here comes Rotom. Okay, so this is actually fine. This is, 
This is probably... Oh, this is tricky. I think actually I go Elsa and I legit just toxic this thing. Cause if it goes King, I obliterate King anyway. Yeah, he's gonna miss the Willow and I hit the toxic, perfect. Okay, I don't care if I get burned. This is actually fine. Like this is exactly what I wanted. I needed to, to set myself up to beat this Rotom. I'm pretty sure he's gonna toxic again. I, or Willow, I could go Scarborn right now. But like, why would I even care if I get toxic? So I think I Icy Wind and then Ice Beam. Here comes the Willow. I don't care if I get Willow. Like, we're gonna Icy Wind and then Ice Beam. Yeah, that's it, baby. That puts us in a spot to beat Rotom. I didn't even need to toxic. I would have been better off not. Ice Beam should finish it off. Dude, tell me how I'm about to no death Giovanni, ladies and gentlemen. Oh man. Here comes Kang again. I mean, we're not out of it yet. Like we still gotta get through Kang, but basically I need to get, I just need to get Walnut. Oh, you know what? He could go, he could go uh, Nido King on the Volt Switch now. He's gonna fake out. I don't necessarily get the Volt Switch for free anymore. Cause he's gonna, he's gonna switch into Nido King now. I think I hard Elsa here, but what, like, is there any benefit to that? I could also just Gyro Ball. I don't want to give him free power up punches. I'm gonna Volt Switch. It's, oh, I just made the best play I could have made. I just saved us hardcore. Wow. Woo, I'm glad I stuck with it. I, I thought Nido King was coming in, but um, man, I thought Nido King was coming in, but my goodness, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right, Scarborn comes in. It beats it beats uh, Kang now. It may switch out, but honestly, I don't. It doesn't matter now. I think I just close combat. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. All I gotta do is beat Nido King now. All I gotta do is beat Nido King now. Let's go, dude. Here comes King. He gets caught in Sticky Web. I could stay in, but because... But because I'm negative defense, like, it doesn't make sense to. So I think the play here is you go Messel, you Power Split, and then you go Frost Moth and Ice Beam and win the game. I think that's 100% the play. Because he can't touch Messel. I mean, he may poison me, but he can't beat Messel in, in more than two hits. No poison, so we Power Split. Nice, dude. <sighs> he crits! Keeping it entertaining, Nido King. I see you. And power split Messel is so clutch. Elsa comes in, and that's game. Wow. Um, I can't believe we just did that. I really can't. That's that is that is the bug squad right there, ladies and gentlemen. That is the bug squad right there, baby. We just beat Giovanni with no deaths. Wow. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That is big. That is big, dude. The impossible run, the bug lock, the bug nuzlocke, ladies and gentlemen. And we get the self scope. My goodness. Get me out of here, please. I think you beat Marowak by poisoning it and then legitimately just swapping back and forth between things and hoping that it doesn't one shot you. Our level cap now goes to 50. I think it actually goes to, oh wait, you have to do, oh, we don't do Sabrina yet. We do Archer, Ariana, Tag Battle. So we do 56. Okay, so we're at the Marowak. Um, all right, everything's healed. So basically Messel needs to Toxic and not miss. This thing is ridiculous. I think they buffed it to give it Swords Dance now, which is kind of crazy because it can set up in your face. I don't think it could do that before. Taunt, it's not even worth it. I think honestly, like my strategy is I legitimately toxic it and then we just beat it with toxic. I just stalled it enough, I think is what I'm gonna try to do. So basically we lead Messel. We're gonna toxic, protect, and then as soon as he attacks me, we're gonna try to rest, I think, if I can. They gave it auto safeguard in hardcore mode. It doesn't have auto safeguard now though, right? If it has auto safeguard now, I legit lose though. I have to just trust that it doesn't because if it does, I'm in a lot of trouble. 
All right, let's do it. Gosh, this is this is ridiculous. Gosh, I hope I really hope I really hope I really hope it doesn't have safeguard. He gets an Omni boost. Okay, I just need to toxic him. He just like fellow blizzards. What is that damage, bro? This is a shuckle, dog. Don't swords dance. Okay. Thank you, SSM. I just, I'm speechless right now. I'm legitimately speechless right now. Like, this is just ridiculous, dude. I think we got it, though. <laughs> I think we're gonna get through this. I think we got it with my really cheesy strategy. I think we got it with our super cheesy strategy. <laughs> Three sturdy Pokemon. Listen, you gotta do what you gotta do. I did not want to lose to this thing. Oh man, I did not want to lose this thing. Do I lose my berry because of this? That's annoying if I do. I did not want to lose this thing. Let's go! <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you everyone. I'm here all day. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> oh man, let me go heal. I think there's trainers up above. Oh my goodness. That thing, I don't even feel bad actually. That thing is stupid busted, bro. So let's just talk about that, right? So it has an ability where if it's a not very effective move, it makes it effective or, or super effective, whatever. And it has thick club, which doubles its attack. And it gets an omni boost that boosts all its stats by one stage. Like, think about that, dude. You can't catch it either now. Wait, did I lose my berry, unfortunately? I did lose my berry earlier, that's dumb. All right, well, I think I could, I should be able to, like, be able to beat this. Uh, these are just some random trainers, so. Uh, yes, Mr. Fuji, I am here. You're welcome. All right, now we got Pokey Flute. Pokey Flute means I technically think I can get the other bugs, right? Yeah, we, I'd have to battle Brendan, though. I have to basically decide whether... If I battle the Archer Ariana team battle, dude, the Archer Ariana team battle is gonna be ridiculous. Okay, so if I chose Squirtle, oh my God, what the French toast? How? Hold up. Well, I know how, hold on. I have some ideas already. I just, I just saw it. Okay, so this is our next boss. This is gonna be ridiculous, but Shedinja Walls three, three of them. <laughs> so, so hold on, <laughs> there's already hope. Okay, so Shedinja Walls, uh, most of the team. Um, let's box everybody and let's start planning this out. Shit into walls so much. Um...